Welcome back to Triple R. We're looking at Street Fighter Alpha Warriors Dreams for the Game Boy Color. This game was released June 5th, 1995. The game fighters in this game are Ryu, Chun Li, Rose, Ken, Guy, Birdie, Saddam, Adon, Charlie, and Sagat. And Bison is a boss in this game. As far as presentation, so the characters are recognizable, but they're not very detailed, like in the fighting mode. Uh, faces are usually blank, making some characters look a bit like android clones of who they are intended to be. Uh, the player select screen does give a, a profile picture with better detail of who's who, along with an oddly egg-shaped globe in the background there. Uh, once the game starts, the camera is drawn back a bit and the sprites are on the smaller side, but they're still big enough. They're not super small. Uh, the stages look good for what they are. The music is decent. The worst part of the sound is the hit detection. It makes almost like a hiss sound. It doesn't sound quite right for like hit detection in the game. So it could be just a technical thing with Game Boy Color, but that really kind of stood out as a drawback to me. As far as gameplay, Street Fighter Alpha plays very solid. For the most part, everyone has their special moves, Hadoukens, Tiger Uppercuts, and so on. Although no voiceovers, so you won't hear any Hadoukens. Uh, the damage can be seem a bit off, but feels like delayed almost on the health bar. Kind of seems a little bit all over the place. Um, there's a super bar, super moves, like in Alpha games, for super Hadoukens, uh, your dragon punches, stuff like that. Uh, the game is nice and fast, as long as you put it on Turbo 2, which I think most people want to play on Turbo 2, Turbo 2 option. Uh, makes for a fun, fast fight. The characters also have endings with some text to tell the outcome for each character after the tournament, which is always nice. I do like some kind of ending. Uh, it'll show the profile picture and the text will be below them. Overall, I was pretty impressed with how this game turned out for a Game Boy Color game. Uh, had the alpha feel. Uh, for a Game Boy Color, I would definitely give this an 8 out of 10. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night wherever you are.